High-tech cancer treatment right here in Baltimore. Our state-of-the-art proton treatment center at the University of Maryland has already helped hundreds of cancer patients. Jessica Kataya explains in today's Health Watch, it's improving their lives in the process. I see you, man. Twice a day for four weeks, John Abel comes here to the Maryland Proton Treatment Center to treat a sarcoma tumor in his abdomen. It's the fourth time he's been diagnosed, but this is different. Going through this now, this the new technology and the proton, this almost, I don't want to say it's fun, but it's amazing. You know, when I come by, it's fun because there's a great team here. Leading the team, Dr. Bill Regine, executive director of the Proton Treatment Center here in Baltimore, where this machine channels a pencil point beam of protons at a tumor. Side effects to other organs are minimized because protons stop at the edge of the tumor, so tissue beyond that tumor doesn't get any excess radiation. A group of patients that this proton radiation is particularly helpful in is people who've had radiation before, their tumor still hasn't spread, but it's grown back. Since opening last year, more than 700 cancer patients have been treated at the facility. Dr. Regine says their quality of life while battling the disease improves significantly with proton treatment. People have less disruption. They can continue to work and not feel like they, you know, are having some side effect they have to deal with that keeps them from working or, you know, even being with their family in a comfortable way. Like Abel, who recently attended his daughter's graduation and is now headed back to the office. There's no I in team, but when I'm here, I feel like it's all about me. There are only 25 proton treatment centers in the U.S., and we're fortunate to have the one right here in Baltimore City. I'm Jessica Cartalia, WJZ. Proton therapy in an outpatient setting means treatment does not require staying overnight in a hospital.